Hey, what's up, guy? And welcome back to Retron Channel on YouTube. So in today's video, I'm going to teach you how to locate the backup folder of your iPhone backup or iPad backup through iTunes. Okay, so normally when you want to secure your iPhone file, you might perform two type of backup, right? One type is an online backup through iCloud, and another one is a backup through computer with the help of iTunes software. So imagine if you are doing the backup. Your phone is somewhere around 64 gig like mine, okay? Mine is 64 gig and a lot of file inside that require a large amount of storage to be stored. So for my case, you can see that my PC is right now is 178 gigabyte free, which is more than enough to store the 64 gig uh, iPhone for two times, right? But I don't want to keep it. I don't want my PC to be purposely used for storing the backup file. So I would want to take the backup file from iTunes, co copy that and paste it into my hard drive or something so that I can keep it more secure. But how are you going to store or copy the backup file when you don't even know where it is, right? So in order to do that, within this video, I'm going to teach you how you can be able to locate the file, copy the file, and store it into your secure location. So let's check about the iTunes first. So this is iTunes. Normally when you want to do the backup, you simply just uh, you need to install iTunes on your PC. So mine is right now on Windows 11. So this is the very latest one, okay? Windows 11 in 2024. So you need to have an iTunes software to be installed and ready on your uh, PC. And then you simply just plug and play with your iPhone or iPad into your PC. So for mine, right now I already plug it. So I press, you got two choices. One is to go with iCloud backup, which will initiating the backup right into your uh, I, uh, Apple ID or some kind, yeah. And another one is an automatically backup within the computer itself, computer itself. So once you press that, you press backup, and then all you need to do is just click on this backup, and then it will send a request message to you, to your, your phone, that you might need to unlock the phone or anything in order to initiate a backup. So for mine is right there. I already initiated the backup, so the phone will processing the backup. So once the backup is ready, where are you going to find the, the folder? Well, very simple and very straightforward at all, actually. So in order to do that, the folder is very secure inside your 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 PC. So in order to locate that, you need to initiate some step. First of all, you need to go to control panel. Okay, follow the step. First of all, you need to go to control panel, and then you need to go to appearance and personalize. So if you're not seeing something like this, maybe you see uh, even more, like, like all of this, right? So if you're seeing something like this, or if you're not seeing something like this, you just simply see the control panel side like this, just go to appearance and personalization, click on that, and you'll find the word file explorer option, and you can click on that to open it, right? Okay, so if you're not seeing something like this, but you're seeing something like this instead, or control panel item like that, you simply locate the file explorer option right there, click on that, it will pop up one window. So in this window, there's nothing to do with general tape. All you need to do is to go to view, and then you need to locate the word hidden file and folders. So you go for show hidden file and folder first, click on that, you click apply, then you click OK. So after that, in order to locate the file, you need to go to anything like admin or something. Yeah, admin, probably admin is the best. Admin, or if you're not on admin, you might be on desktop like this, or you might be on document like this. Just simply click on this. Uh, how do I say? Yeah, C with, with this one, huh? C slash users, something like that, and it will land like this. So then you will be able to locate the word admin or something. Yeah, if your if your username was admin, probably admin. If you're not, then find your username. So for mine right now is admin. I'm going to click on admin, and then you will see a bunch of all of this stuff, right? Actually, all of this stuff is not available right after you... This is only available right after you click on showing the hidden folder because those this folder is actually a hidden folder. Okay, so after you land on admin, let me do it again. Go to user, go to admin, and then you look for uh, Apple data. Oh, I'm sorry, not, not, not app data. You go to Apple right here, okay? Click on Apple, you will see the word mobile sync. So this mobile sync is actually a folder that locate and store all your iPhone backup. So once you click on this, you will see the word back. You will see the word backup, right? So then you click on backup, then this is this is the file. This is the file that you you need to copy and paste into 
wherever you want. So this is the backup file from the previous backup on of my iPhone. Okay, so inside there's a lot of folder, tons of folder, but you're not required to look at that, or you're not required to care about any of that. Just simply copy copy this folder and paste it into wherever you want. Okay, again, I'll repeat the step. If you haven't done anything yet, okay, let me undo all the stuff as well. Appear in personalization, file explorer option, and I'm gonna disable this. So this is what you are going to see. Okay, this is what you actually see if you're not enable all of that. Okay, admin, and you go to Apple, Apple, mobile sync. So first of all, all you need to do is to go to control panel, go to appear and personal personalization, and then you go for file explorer option, and then you go for view, and then you go for show hidden file and folder and driver drive okay click on that apply okay after that you go to admin or any username that you are naming your computer if it is beside admin just click on that folder and then you'll notice the word apple click on apple there will be a folder name mobile sync click on mobile sync there's a backup click on backup there's another folder which actually indicate that this is the backup folder of your previous backup phone. If you have a multiple backup and you don't know which one it is, just simply look for the latest date modified. For mine, it's just doing the backup. It's at 8.52 p.m. 28 uh, September 2024. So this is the file, okay? So simply copy that and paste to wherever I want. And then later, if you need to restore backup, just simply go to iTunes, the same thing, and click on restore backup like this. And it will uh, restore the backup. It will it will it will ask you to browse the the backup folder, and then you can simply just restore it, re restore your phone backup, right into the previous mode that it was in. So that's it. So this is how you actually able to locate the backup folder of your iPhone backup within iTunes on Windows 11. So thank you guys for watching. This is uh, quite a long video, but I will make it short. So thank you very much, and see you in the next video. Bye for now.